What's going on guys, it's Roman from Pitch Invasion TV uh, in another vlog episode. What have I been up to since last time we did this? We made a video uh, with Oakley, uh, who's known as Oaklefish. We did a just a meet the YouTuber segment. You know, it was meant to be, you know, just, just a nice little uh, video. And we ended up doing the worst forfeit possible. Naga ghost chilies. Oh, I'm joking, just talking about the chili just makes me feel sick. So we did the challenge and it was just absolutely horrendous. Possibly one of the most horrific moments in my life. Check out the video, I promise you you won't be disappointed. It is absolutely fucking hilarious. Um, it's jokes, but do not try it at home. I'm telling you, it's not fun. So today's vlog, um, as we always do a hashtag with each vlog, um, is gonna be entitled King Louis. It's gonna be about Louis Suarez. And we actually had a video in uh, from a subscriber called Dylan and Dylan's channel will be in the description below so you can check that out He basically wanted to hear my thoughts on Luis Suarez what I think of him because you know He's a controversial topic some people like him some people absolutely despise the guy the situation is Luis Suarez Let's see what hasn't he done so bit of guy in the neck bit of guy in the arm racially abused another player Handballed a potential goal off the line. Dives nearly every match. Openly said that he hates the English press. He's always in the media for the wrong reasons. Um, however, there's absolutely no denying that he's an amazing player. You know, he's done all those bad things. I mean, like, if you look at some of the bites that he makes on these people, it's absolutely horrendous. He's just like... <laughs> and then he gets on with the game. He's got a taste for flesh. But he'll get your goals. Um, but I saw, we saw this kind of like in the summer when, when there was all that like 40 million and one pound bid from Arsenal. I saw Arsenal fans being like, oh no, uh, he's rubbish, like, he, like we don't want that sort of scum at our club and that. And it's like, come on man, like, think how much testosterone players have got going in a game, yeah? Like you don't know what's going through. Like, why do you think you see punch-ups in football matches, yeah? You don't know, like some people bite, some people slap, some people punch, some people kick. I mean, look. Jermaine Defoe has done the biting thing. He bit Mascherano. They, you go and have a look. He bit Mascherano on the arm. He only got a yellow card for it and the referee acknowledged it. No one ever talks about that. Not ever. Players like Eric Cantona. The guy karate kicked a fan in the face. Yes, Luis Suarez has done the racism thing. Yes, and he categorically came out and apologised for his statement. If a man apologises, you can't just keep going back on it and you can't just keep criminalising him for something that he's apologised for, you know, he, he served a ban for it, and rightly so, absolutely rightly so. But, you know, I'm sure everyone has kind of got on with it. I'm sure everyone else has kind of got on with it. And that's what kind of annoyed me, like, when, you know, Arsenal fans are turning around being like, oh, we wouldn't want him at our club, and all this stuff. And it was kind of the same with Liverpool fans. Liverpool fans started to turn saying, yeah, he's a scum at our club. But at the end of the day, guys, on the Premier League trophy, or on any trophy, it's not going to be engraved this was won by Luis Suarez, it's going to say Liverpool or Arsenal or whoever. You know, it's, it's a team effort at the end of the day. But there's no denying having him on your team will make you a better side. Why wouldn't you want that? I'm going to push the boat out here, yeah? I rate him as the third best player in the world. Messi, Ronaldo, Suarez. He has that raw ability, yeah? Just pure grit and anger, but the technical ability is unreal. I mean, look at that goal that he scored against Newcastle. That's not a fluke. We've seen him do stuff like that before. You know, the guy's technically gifted, ridiculous, yeah? And the, the question that kind of Dylan was asking me was, you know, in comparison to someone like Gareth Bale's fee, I think Luis Suarez absolutely blows Gareth Bale out of the water. But for some reason with Suarez, it just, it, he hasn't got any luck. Like, it doesn't seem like he's got the luck that he should deserve. And I think this is going to piss off a lot of Liverpool fans. I think he's absolutely wasted at a club that's not in the Champions League. If Luis Suarez was in the Champions League, tomorrow he would be worth 100 million. For everything that the guy's done wrong, his pros outweigh his cons massively. Anyway guys, if you liked the video, or if whatever reason you disagree, please comment down below. I really do want to hear and I'll be answering you all back in the comment section down below. Thanks to Dylan for posting his video and very kindly asking if I would do uh, this for you guys. So that's how I feel about Luis Suarez. Uh, so that's it guys. Uh, thanks very much. I've been Roman. I'll see you later. <laughs>
Schreiben. <lacht> <lacht>